first of all, <laughs> I think I want to say thank you for everyone who has listened to Sunlight so far. Um, you've said wonderful things about it. I know it's like the first thing I've put out, the first song I've put out. We're working. It's a work in progress, as anything is, but sometimes you just have to do stuff, and you can't be held back by, oh my god, what if people don't like it, because you're never going to please everyone. Um, I've learned that. Um, but I did want to kind of give a little backstory behind it and like kind of where this is all coming from. I wrote that song about two years ago. It sat in my notebook for about a year and a half and I was like, this is ridiculous. You have to do something with it. I was going to do something with my songs. Spring, summer of last year, got a little busy, got a little distracted um, with other things, but kind of had a change of resolve around the beginning of the year and really knew I needed to do something. So this is one of the songs I thought was probably in the best shape to go ahead and just get in the studio and do. So I went ahead and recorded it. I recorded at Little Pioneer um, with Craig Levy. Um, I found out about him through Wendy Ho. Um, I've, if you don't know who she is, she's wonderful. She's <laughs> a little raunchy, a little you know, it's a blue humor, but it's funny. She's wonderful, but um, a lot of her recordings have, Craig has produced those. And um, I finally just went ahead and called him up, sent him a couple of rough demos, and we went in and did the thing. It was interesting. I say the most challenging part of recording it was other than listening to myself. I don't think many singers like to listen to themselves. I am not a singer who really likes to listen to themselves. I have to really be in a place so that was hard, but I'd say the hardest part was um, fleshing out some of the tracks, some of the orchestrations, because that was on me. And like I don't play a lot of keyboard, but a lot of the, like, the bass line that you hear, that's me playing on the keyboard. Thank God it's 2018 and I only have to do it right once. <laughs> and you can just keep duplicating it over and over again because it's 2018 and we're in the studio. I'm definitely looking forward to getting back so the story behind Sunlight. You now, like I said, I wrote the song about two years ago. It was when I was in the middle of a situation with a guy, and I was very much the third wheel or something like that in this situation. Very much the other woman. And as much as I enjoyed spending time with him, we would have like great times, wonderful evenings. I would know that the mornings weren't really going to be my time. Maybe a little bit of time in the morning, but by a certain point, someone's coming home. And it's best that either I'm not there or at least not in the bed with you when that person gets home. So, yeah, it's over. The situation's over. It's in the past. It's history. But that's the story. Yeah, it's really about enjoying wonderful times with someone that you know you cannot be with. Who's occupied and it's probably not going to change. <laughs> That's the song. It is up on my YouTube channel, it's up on my SoundCloud. Um, and while you're at it, while we're talking about the social media and things, I think it goes without saying, if you're watching, it would you know, mean the world to me if you just subscribe to the channel. I do lots of other things, of course, um, I have a vlog. Um, there's more music coming, all sorts of things will end up on this channel that you don't want to miss. So go ahead and give it a subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful day, evening. I don't know where you're watching or what time it is, but enjoy your day. <laughs> Gotta go my way. There's nothing more. See you next.